black women are the new rich. <laughs> Hey girls, welcome back to my channel. My name is Summerly. If you're new here, and if you're a returning subscriber, girl, as you can see, we got a new scenery behind us. I am loving it. Like, are you serious right now? Are you serious? We're taking it up a notch. Like, we are. We're taking it up and out. It's time for a new everything, a new vibe, a new me. It's time to just take our lives up and out. Like, it's time. Like, what we've been waiting for. Who we've been waiting on. Yeah. So, I'm here to film a long-awaited video that has been on my mind for some time. It's been on my mind to so go ahead and get this done. It's something that needs to be talked about. It needs to be brung up. It's, it's time. It's time to talk about this. We've been waiting too long to talk about this. A lot of you have followed me because I promote black women in luxury. Black girl luxury, black women in luxury, however you want to call it. I promote it because I'm a part of that group. I am a part of that group. Like I live a soft, beautiful life, comfortable, peaceful, just everything soft, a soft life. And that's what we're in right now. We're in the era where black women are the new rich been wanting to shoot content on this subject for the longest because I feel like a lot of y'all came to my channel because this is something I promote this is something I believe in this is something that even when I wake up and I want to live in luxury and I just feel like it has been mis like interpreted misconstrued in a way where luxury is only material things it's only going to the nicest no luxury is whatever you make it whatever you believe makes your life luxurious comfortable peaceful soft loving that's what is luxury to you luxury can mean different things there is a definition out there but luxury can mean different things in my opinion and like i said this video so this video is based on my opinions. You are free to yours. You can leave a comment down below, but let's not tussle in the comments. Let's keep it real cute. So I'm going to look up the definition of what luxury means. And luxury is the state of great comfort and extravagant living. Um, let's, let's find another one just to make sure we're on the same page. So another um, definition is a condition of abundance or great ease and comfort. And that's exactly what I'm trying to live. I'm trying to live in comfort, peace, abundance. I'm trying to exceed the old person I was last year. So I just want to really speak on black women in luxury. I want to speak on a little life update of me. How do I balance my life of being and living in a luxurious environment and just let's talk about it it's, it's time girl so i got my matcha green tea latte and a lot of y'all asked me what i order i um get a iced matcha green latte with brown sugar syrup um one pump one pump of sugar-free vanilla and i get sweet cream and cold foam on top it's the it girl drink it is the it girl drink like i promise you this is the it girl drink. So I'm gonna take a sip. And while I'm taking a sip, you can go get your wine, you can go get your mimosa, you can go get your starbucks, you can go get your coffee. Get whatever, girl, because this we gotta talk about it. Let's start on the topic of black women in luxury. So I don't know how long this has been around, but lately this has been the new thing. This is the new topic, and I am here for it. I'm here for it. I'm here for everything that promotes black women because, of course, I am. Anything that makes us stand out, anything that promotes us growing as a person, I'm here for it. Like, why not? How I see black girl luxury, like I said, this is my opinion. It is living in your truth, being who you are, promoting your health mentally, physically, emotionally, all the above, taking care of yourself, doing what you love, putting yourself first, that is a black girl luxury to me. Anything where you're able to step out and step in meetings, rooms that you've never been in and step out of your comfort zone, that is black girl luxury to me. It's not just buying the ladies, being in the ladies, having the nicest thing. I would like that too. But at the same time, is that really what encompasses the whole black girl luxury? So I see a lot of TikToks. A 
a lot of reels in which I make, I make reels that promotes black girl luxury. And I just feel like it's getting misconstrued because just to be honest, on my reel, I made, it was like pictures of nice things while I went shopping. It was a picture of my dog. It was a little picture of my man. It was a picture of a quote. It was a picture of it snowing outside. Like that, that's what made me happy. That's what I consider my luxury lifestyle. I had one girl comment or one little hater comment and was like, um, so this is what you define as happy, happiness material things. And I'm just like, did you watch the real like throughout its entirety did you not see snow falling from the sky that's what made me happy i just don't want this topic to get misconstrued and misinterpreted because black women can be smart we can be intelligent a go-getter a gold digger like it's more than us just buying things so for me personally i um went to college and now i'm creating content that i really love so i'm a content creator too and it makes me so happy to say that so i want to from my channel and from my story i want you to know i promote all black girl luxury things but i want you to know what it came with to get to the point that i am i want you to know my background what hard work i put in like i'm just not this girl living in luxury like i had to work hard for this to live a comfortable soft life a lot of my girls from instagram came to my youtube channel and i know y'all saw my reels so i just want to explain. start from the top i'm from mcintosh alabama a small town you can google it i'm from mcintosh alabama it's like 30 minutes from mobile alabama however i did go to high school in mobile so um you can say i'm from mcintosh mobile what have you but either or i'm from alabama alabama made me i'm from alabama so i went to AM university where i graduated with my bachelor's and i also got my master's from there um i throughout those years i worked at taco bell in high school i had internships um i worked at kroger the grocery store throughout college what i worked at charlotte rue so I just want y'all to know, and that's just a brief background of what I've done. Like, I I worked and bust my ass off to get where I am today in the engineering field. Um, yes, I am a engineer as well. So, I just don't live a luxurious lifestyle where I wake up and create content. I go to work every day, Monday through Thursday. I work four tens every week. So, I go to work. I put in the work. I don't live a luxurious lifestyle where I'm just out here just getting money from looking cute or doing what I do. I mean, I do make money from that, but other than that, I have other sources of income to support my lifestyle. So, back to lifestyle. It's whatever you make it. Like, my sister and I, we are day and night. Things that make her happy makes her happy things that make me happy make me happy like my sister doesn't wear makeup none of that and she lives a comfortable soft life still like that's just an example of it's whatever makes you happy it's whatever you do i just don't want girls like younger girls i've seen that's been following me that has came to my channel i just want to spread this announcement it's more than just material things it's more than just that you can go to school you can be a content creator you can like it's so many different things that you can do don't just feel like you're in a rush to live this luxurious lifestyle and do one certain thing like it's whatever you make it so i just wanted to get that out there and i'm so glad that i did it's been a long awaited and i think i'm gonna keep doing like a little um episodes of black girl and luxury so y'all send me topics on what you guys want to speak about black girl and luxury to me also means being mentally physically emotionally everything prepared plan out everything i have a plan for everything i write everything out if you fail to plan you're planning to fail i live by that like i love planning things out so with me always having things to do as far as a content creator going to work every week and then the a it girl it's hard work. It takes a toll on me. So I am a planner girl. I'm that girl that carries a planner, write everything out, or I will forget. 
So I want to take the time out during this beautiful video to say thanks to A Queen's Lifestyle for sending me over their planner in which I did take a sneak peek and I love it. Like, I'm about to show y'all. So this is the Queen's Lifestyle planner. It is so beautiful. Y'all, look at the packaging. Top tier. Y'all know I'm a sucker for packaging. Y'all know I'm a whore for packaging. If it's cute packaging, I know I'm a little product. Like, 10 to 100 times more so she also sent me over a pen so i'm not gonna lie y'all i kind of looked at it the other day when she sent it but i didn't look at it in its entirety so i can be genuine about my response to y'all because i feel like y'all need to go get this to have a luxurious lifestyle you have to plan it out you have to manifest it you have to want it you have to think you have to see it every day you have to believe that you're going to be that girl you have to so i'm about to unbox it y'all so when you open it look at it it comes in silk just look at this it comes in silk and it comes with so many things so we're just gonna go through so on top is envelopes and in each envelope i'm about to see because i haven't looked at it honestly in each envelope Oh, it's a budget sheet. So, y'all know how everyone does like the $5 savings. Every time you get $5, you put it in the envelope. This will be perfect for that. And you can store it away for hard times because expenses do come up. So, that's cute. Oh, then she has the stickers. Little cute stickers that has health, savings, income, electric, all of that. And then she has a cute dedication card. This is so cute. More stickers, as y'all can see. And she sent over a thank you card. And y'all, working with her throughout this entire experience has been so, like, I don't know. It's been humbling for me in a way because she's just so sweet. And she trusts me with her brand. And... We had a little bump in the road where we thought we lost the package throughout. And I was just like, God, this is like the devil is trying to get in this. So I know it's meant for me. Like, I'm about to go 10 times hard for her brand just because she took out her time and her money to send me this. And the devil want to lose the package, I bet. But anyways, it comes in like this silk packaging box. It is so cute. I love that for me. And... This is the planner. Do y'all see how thick this is? This is the planner. So on the front, it has a Queen's Lifestyle Planner, Alicia Inner Queen. And on the back is With Your Crown, Confidence and Lifestyle Planner. You are ready to sell the world. That is so cute. So when I open it on the inside, it has a pocket to hold things. It has your table of contents. So I'm just gonna go throughout like the stuff that catches my eye with this because it's so much. Like y'all, this is a book. It is so much. So when you open it, it has like a little welcoming statement. It also has um, a queen's bio. It has so much stuff. It has a password manager. I don't personally write down my passwords because if I lose this, I will be devastated. Um, so, okay, it has a gold getter horoscope. So, if you're into horoscopes, let's see. I'm a Virgo, so I'm going to read that first. I'm going to just read a few. So, for the Virgo, if you don't go after it, you'll never achieve it. That's probably why I was just saying all that to y'all about you got to go after it. You got to be a go getter. That's definitely why. Let's see. A Scorpio is dream big, set goals, take action. A Taurus is my goals are manifesting. Okay. A Pisces is set goals, reach goals, repeat. So she has a brainstorming page. I love that because I like to brain dump a lot. A lot. She has a page for setting your goals. And I'm going to do a sit down with this tool for my reels it's a debt tracker so you can help with your credit that's another thing make sure your credit good make sure 
So, here goes another horoscope page, y'all. It says, in my bag, horoscope. Virgo, I my feelings in my bag, and this is that on that. A Libra is, I want financial stability. Gemini, I'm all about the money. Okay, Geminis. Pisces, I embrace new avenues of income. A Capricorn, wealth constantly flows into my life. Okay. Then she has a stack, stack of novel, please. Stack. Olipi. So, this is where you can play a little game in her book. Okay, so stack them coins. Let's save those coins. Is what she said. Next page, she has like an emergency fund. She has meal planning, grocery lists. Like, this is just, she has a My Habit Tracker that I really need to start using because, hmm. Oh, she has a My Fitness Goal Worksheet. This is what I really need. My fitness goal worksheet because y'all know I've been on my oh my gosh, she is a queen's prayer. This planner is oh, she has a my beauty shop list. Y'all, if y'all don't go get this planner, she has a 30 day self care challenge. Day one, meditate for five minutes. Day 10, plan a date night. A monthly budgeting worksheet. This planner is literally everything. She has a monthly reflection. I just, I don't know what else to tell y'all. Y'all need to go get this planner, seriously. It's time. It's time. It's time to really start taking life serious. It's time for if you really want to be a black woman in luxury, being the it girl mentally physically financially like all of that so i just feel as though if my channel is going to promote black girl luxury i want to speak on it more make sure we're all on the same page about what is black girl luxury and also understand who we are what we're here for live out through our purpose pursue our passion we have created this bond this family I'm so grateful for all the support you guys are showing me. And I continue, and I want to continue to build this bond with you guys. Love y'all so much, and see y'all next video.